Hey, what's up, nerds? Recent events have left me feeling a bit meh on magic. This isn't the video I planned to make, but it's the video I had to. I'm going to keep this pretty simple. I've lost a little bit of the magic for magic, and it happened because of two distinct events. A lot of people have talked about, is it the old school MTG? fellow that got the Pinkertons sicked on him. I shall hunt you to the ends of the earth and the end of time. Yeah, that was kind of a, a shit deal. I'm not saying the Pinkertons are nice people. They're a private security firm. And anytime there's something like that, you know, there's some shady business. But on the other hand, the guy did open an embargoed product and corporations are going to try and shut that down. I'm not saying either side was right, and I'm definitely not blaming him. But it did make me feel kind of sick and sad. All the the negativity that has then surrounded magic. All I know is it made me sad. On a couple of levels. Number one, he spoiled a little over half of a 50-card set. He opened a box. Actually, I think he had two videos at least. And he opened, like, in the first box, he didn't even spoil the whole 50-card set. And let's do the math real quick, okay? Five-card boosters, and there were 12 in there. So he, he opened 60 cards, and he spoiled a little over half of a 50-card set. That means you're going to get a lot of repeats <laughs> if you're trying to complete a set, which... Kind of sort of brings me to topic number two. So I bought a case of March of the Machine collector boosters. That's, that's a lot of money for me. I know there's whales out there that are like, open five cases, you know, whatever, man, what's your problem? But my intention was to try to put together a set of March of the Machine. I didn't really come close with a case of collector boosters. I didn't even come close to completing a set of Multiverse Legends after opening a case of March of the Machine boosters. Understand that there were three, I think three, Multiverse Legend cards in each pack. So there's 72 packs I opened, and I didn't come close. Here's my numbers. Okay, for the set... I'm still missing 10 Mythic cards from the base set. And they're not the cheap ones either. I'm missing four of the five Praetors. I'm missing some other important cards that are pricey. I'm also missing four rares. And that's after opening 72 packs. Multiverse Legends. I'm still missing six Mythics and one rare. And they're not the cheap ones. Because Ragavan happens to be one of them that I didn't get out of opening 72 packs. That left me pretty sour. And I kind of questioned, like, was it worth it? And it really wasn't. Yeah, I pulled a couple of serialized cards. Probably going to sell those to help recoup some of the cost of the of the thing. Because I, I, I don't know. I'm just not moved by them. Sorry. So all this has left me kind of feeling a little sour. And I think the only solution for me at this point is to probably jump back in and go vintage for a while. Because right now, this new stuff, I don't think it's worth it. Am I quitting collecting magic? No, probably not. Just have a little ashy taste in my mouth right now. You guys take care. Have a good week. I hope you can find the magic this week. Because I sure can't. See you soon.